Greetings ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VI and in the last episode we began exploring the Cave of the Seal or the Seal Cave or the Cave of the Seal Gate and at the end of the episode I screwed myself out of a chest by hitting a wrong switch and I just have to leave and come back in and now oh apparently there's a switch in the chest I guess we're meant to flick the switch well I was expecting some sick loot but apparently not and yeah We've been fighting a whole lot of these outcast guys, and they're getting really annoying. So much so that just for the sake of speeding up the battle, I'm just attacking with Setzer now, because I cannot be bothered to input his slots every time. Because there are just too many of these guys. Anyway, I believe uh, Sets is about to level up. I would be correct. And Gar is next, but hopefully we can get enough experience to where they level up in the same fight. Wow, Edgar is just a machine right now. Get it? Because he's a machinist? <laughs> He's doing crazy good damage. Obviously, Gore is doing the most, but you know, at least Edgar's isn't random. Learning spells. Not too far. Let's do that. Oh, yes. Yeah, I'm enjoying Gore while he lasts. I know he's not going to be, like, that amazing for the whole game. Because, you know, the rages are random. So he probably will fall off a bit. But, you know, he's really freaking good right now. He did just level up, didn't he? Yes. I am correct. Another Magicite shot. Yeah, I don't know about those. Apparently they summon a random Esper. This looks like a secret passage. I don't really want to use one of the Magicite Shards, so I don't know how rare they are, but, you know, we've got three of them now, so... But, you know, maybe we don't get many more of them aside from this area, so you never know. I guess I'll save them for, like, boss fights or something. But I can imagine it'd be quite annoying, like, if we get Carbuncle and it casts Reflect on us when we don't want to be reflective. <laughs> HP is in the thousands now. Okay, it's not a secret passage. Disappointing. Oh, this looks ominous. Better heal, right? I guess we made it to the gate, right? Yes, sir. If that ain't the sealed gate, I don't know what is.
From here on out, it's all up to you, Terra. Oh, what am I doing in a dreadful place like this? So, uh, guess you would have unique dialogue depending on who you brought with you. Gordon didn't feel like saying anything. He usually never does. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Sonic? <laughs> yeah, someone made a comment about Sonic.exe. Kafka's laughing using that, which just shames me. Oh, wait, what? Kafka, okay, Kafka followed us here for one. We're also separated. This theme is awesome as well. I don't think we've heard this yet. Give them terror and they'll open the gate for us. In other words, you've been playing into our hands all along. Hehehe. <laughs> I have no business with you. I'm here to open the way to my promised glory. Bad think again, Kafka. Oh dear. You want to fight, don't you? This is just dreadful. You have to keep Kafka busy until Terra steps through the gate. I mean, Gore will keep him busy. Oh. The door is opening. Oh, crap. Look at that pink hair. Espers, heed my call. Wow. Just opened on up like that, eh? It's open, it's open! Zara! I... I... I've got a bad feeling about this! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god! Is that the man himself, Bahamut? Who the fuck was that? Jesus. Such frightful energy. How is that wolf flying? Oh my god, what is going on? What? Okay, Shiva, why are you here? We already got you. Crikey. They just flew on over and closed the gate again. Oh wow. Guess that's that for the gate, huh? How did the espers go? Better head back to the airship. What even just happened? Do we have to walk all the way out? We can just teleport. I'm gonna teleport. That's what it's there for, right? Holy crap, though. I do not even know right now. <laughs> I think I'm going the wrong way around, haven't I? This is definitely not yet. God damn it. Oh, hey, look. The espers all flew off together. The Imperials ran off too as if they were afraid of something. Which way did the espers go? Towards the Imperial camp. Vector. Shit. Are they just gonna assault Vector? What's wrong, Terra? I can feel them. They're getting closer. You can feel what? There, a flash. What was that? It couldn't be. The espers? They're coming this way. Watch out! Oh my god, Bahama, leave us alone! <laughs> this is craziness! Yep, yeah, sets it. 
It's what we've been going on about this whole time. <coughs> Excuse me. I don't really blame them. I mean... Huh? What is going on right now? No. Are we really gonna crash the ship right now? Are you serious? Game? No. Don't crush my airship. Please. Please. You gotta be fucking kidding me, right? Are you serious right now? <laughs> we can't have nice things, can we? Can't even have an airship. I mean, it looks like it's in one piece, but I'm guessing it won't fly. We're all just chilling still. Did it crash? What? What do we do? How do I leave? I'm so confused right now. I can't operate the ship. Like, everyone's just chilling. Everyone's chilling like nothing freaking happened. What the fuck, game? <laughs> I'm so confused right now. I don't know if I'm being super dumb or what. Like, what are we supposed to do right now? shit here, I guess. <sighs> so we've got to walk to Vector, I'm guessing, right? And the airship just stranded next to Miranda. Oh, game, are you serious? You're going to make me walk and fight all these guys? And Terra apparently automatically learned Fire by level up. Which is cool. Okay, no level ups for a while now. So the airship crashed, but it's like <laughs> apparently still all in one piece? I don't even know. I guess we just have to go to Vector. I'm not going to ask him any questions. Oh, for fuck's sake. I don't know why it's not it saved my uh, remember. 
That made no sense. My uh, memory cursor. Well. Oh, I'm so dumb. Don't. Oh. Not much further, I guess. I thought we crushed in the sand. Why can't we be crushed here? It looked like we crashed into sand. Unless there was sand down there and I didn't even notice. Oh my god, I'm so dumb! I'm just on automatic, just pressing A. Game, come on. Stop barraging me with encounters, please. I did it again, didn't I? <laughs> Finally. We made it to Vector. So what the fuck is going on? Someone? Anyone? I don't know what happened. Why the return is it? Oh wait! That's on fire. It's all on fire. The Nash guards are here, the returners are here, and it's all on fire. Did we do this? I don't think so, because they're all questioning what happened. This doesn't spell the good things. I mean, I, I guess Vex is on fire, which is which is good for us. Crap. But yeah, what is going on? They're all just asking what's going on. Do we go in, do we get to go into the, oh hi Bannon. Tell me what the fuck's up. The Espers do this? I mean Gestel kind of like Screw them over. I wouldn't be surprised if the Espers did this. Yeah, so I guess now we can explore. Alright. Oh, hello. Amber's expecting me. Really now? Emperor Gestor is expecting me. The Emperor imprisoned Kefka after he learned about everything he's done. It sounds like Kefka may end up spending the rest of his life behind bars. Really? The war's over? What? <laughs> this has to be, like... I've lost my will to fight. Nah, you're lying. You're a liar. You're a straight up liar, bro. The Empress had a change of heart. Bullshit. The Espers came to save their friends. Well, yeah, of course, because the yeah, the freaking they've been keeping them hostage, sucking them while they're alive, and they're all their power. Of course, they're gonna come here and attack. What do you expect? I mean, I get yeah, that's why they imprisoned Kefka because Kefka knew. He wanted the Espers to be released. He probably knew this is what would happen. No, I think they just have it out for you, to be honest. They were kind of chilling with us. <laughs> yeah, it's alright saying that now, Sid, when it's basically like, you know, 
You made all this Magitech crap. Let's speak more over dinner tonight. There are still some soldiers who prefer to keep fighting. Please talk to as many before dinner. Make them understand. Oh my god. I remember this. Because you've got to go around and talk to the soldiers. And you get like so many... Like, if you, Depending on how many you get, you get a reward or something. I remember doing this. You're on like a timer. This is like a timed event. You have four minutes until dinner. Please talk to as many soldiers as you can. Well, fuck you. <laughs> I'm going to make a safety save. Right now. Because I don't know what to expect. Okay. So, like... Who, how do we know which soldiers want to keep fighting? How do we know? One soldier. Oh. Two soldiers. So they all count. Gotta be quick. Gotta be quick. Let my way around here. Okay, alarm airing. X potion. I guess I'll pick up some treasure on the way. Don't know what those do. I guess I won't check yet. Oh, loads of soldiers in here. Yeah, so the poison. So he's been locked up for the poison. Oh, wow. This guy attacks you? So you can get attacked by random ones as well. No. No. Bad. Aspirin. That's also bad. Do Gigavolt. <laughs> Wow, this is not going well. I've been attacked by... Oh, okay, so you still count. Yes, they probably did. You're the same guy. Really? Move out my freaking way! It's been shut down. Yeah, so you can't go back there, I'm, I'm guessing. What did he say? Hold up, what did that guy just say to us? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Dead. Can't be pushed around. <laughs> what? I don't even know. Hey, bro. I'm with the Empire. Fuck you. Fuck you. Kept a scum. Yep, he is. I'm glad you didn't attack me. Holy shit. Out of my way. Out of my way. My whole family in the war. I don't know if there's soldiers up there. There is soldiers up there. Oh my god. Oh, that was the wrong door. Oh, I didn't realize that. Oh, I'm so dumb. Just talk to me. I'm not going in that door. I'm not going to risk going in that door. I'm just going around the other side. I don't know how many you need to get to get like a reward or something. I just remember doing this. So I remember there was a timed event inside the palace. There needs to be another room full of soldiers. Okay, it's two. Move out of my way, I want the chest. A gale hairpin. Plenty. This definitely is not a perfect run. <laughs> uh, I've definitely missed some. Oh, that's Kefka. Oh, fuck no. I think we can go outside, right? Are there more outside? Yeah. Oh, fuck off. I don't want to fight. I've only got a minute left. Please Gigavolt, you fucking penis. <laughs> That's how strong I am. It's freaking chainsaw your face off. I can't... What? Why can I not get past you? I can't get past this guy, okay. I'm still alive, motherfucker. Is that it then? Did I get them all? 
I don't know. Twenty-three? I feel like I've missed some. I can't have. I've been up here. I've been all around. I don't know where else there is for me to go. Apart from in that room that I skipped, but is there going to be soldiers in there? There probably were soldiers in there, wasn't there? Oh, I might still be able to get them. Oh, 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 oh. oh no, 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 no. Seven seconds! Are you fucking kidding me? Please count, please count, please count, please count. Count. If you don't count, I'm going to shoot myself. One. If this doesn't count. 24. I think I got all of them. There was nowhere else I could have gone. That was the last second. Oh my god. Jesus. That evening a banquet was held with the Emperor. This way, please. I vaguely remember this from when I played. I'll sit with the returners if that's alright. Do we have to actually answer guests or here? We don't just watch. I think we act it's like choice dialogue, right? Alas, we can all be together sharing a meal at the same table. That is, make a toast. Yeah, this is crazy. You wouldn't think this would be happening at the beginning of the game, would you? Yeah, see? We get to pick. So the Empire to the Returners to our homeland. So honestly, if we pick the Returners, he's probably not going to like it. If we pick the Empire, that's not good for us. He needs to be like, what, you mean, what do you mean? I'm thinking the Homelands is probably the best one. I'm not looking this up. Like, I... There's probably rewards I'm missing if I fuck this up. But you know what? It's my first time playing. Technically. As you may know, I've imprisoned Kefka for his crimes of using poison against Doma. What do you think should be done with him? Leave him in jail, pardon him, execute him. Uh, Leave him in jail. Let's... Let him stew in his cell for a while, then we can decide what to do. I'm truly sorry for about what occurred in Doma. I can imagine if Cyan was here, he'd probably have some extra dialogue. No one ever dreamed Kefka would use poison. What's done is done, that was inexcusable. Apologize again! Uh, that was inexcusable. I'm terribly sorry about what was done. I promise to punish Kefka severely and to work on eradicating poisons all over the world. With regard to General Sellers, yeah, how's she doing? Is she an Imperial spy? Sellers is one of us, we trust her whether she's spied or not. I mean, was she an Imperial spy? Kefka was lying. General Sellers realized the lunacy of this war long before I did and went over to your side. Was there anything else you wanted to ask? Why did you start the war? Why do you want peace now? Why do we have to talk to your men? Why did you start the war? It was all the result of my foolish loss of power. I've come to my senses now. Really now? Just gonna get espers. Still have a few things to ask, okay. Oh, we can just go back to this. Why do you want peace now? Because I now believe that working together is only a hope. Okay, let's talk about the espers. The Empire has been decimated by the Espers that emerge from the Steel Gate. They're just too powerful. If we don't do something, they'll tear the entire world apart. They've gone a bit too far. You're the one who brought them here in the first place. I don't think he would like it if I said that, so... It is his fault, though. <laughs> Entirely. When the Espers came through on their rampage, all of my ambitions faded in an instant. Now I find myself asking why I've wanted that much power in the first place. Of course, there is no excuse for the atrocities I committed in the name of the Conquest. Yeah, yeah. By the way, what was the first question you asked me a minute ago? I asked you, why did you start the war? Oh, that's just the game trying to trip you up. That's bullshit from a story perspective. <laughs> like, that's just... Yeah. I'm getting tired. Let me just take a short break. Okay. I just run around and talk to people. Okay. 
We're just fighting in the dining room. Apparently there's a two minute timer. Don't know why it takes us that long to kill these guys. Oh, a match side shot, cool. Just thought. Oh, they, do they all say the same thing? Yeah. Da, da, da. You're a phony. Resume. Is there anything you wish to hear me say? That you really want peace? That you're always truly over? That you're sorry? That you really want peace? After they attacked us, the Espers flew off northward towards Crescent Island. We now we have no way of knowing when they'll decide to go on another rampage. Crescent Island, eh? That's familiar. We need to find them and convince them to set aside their aggression before that happens. But considering all that the Empire has done to them, I doubt they'll be willing to listen to us. That's why I need to borrow Terra's power. Are you joking? <laughs> Terra is the only one who can bridge the gap between human and Esper. I have a Magitek armor transport ship moored in the port of Albrook. I'd hope to send it to Crescent Island with all haste. If you please go on board. I mean, I guess if we say no, it would piss them off. Uh, I do believe this is the next story section, so... Alright. I'll have my top general and some of his troops accompany you as well. General Leo? Hey, it's Leo again. How's it going, my man? General Leo, please make your acquaintance. I'll be waiting for you in Albrook. Please, find the Espers and convince them to cease their attacks. You're our only hope. Alright. Terra goes, I go. Alright, Log. <laughs> the rest of you stay here. I smell a rat. Okay, as do I, it's hard to trust the Emperor just like that. Yeah, we ain't trusting that bitch. We'll remain here and watch out for anything out of the ordinary. Thanks, you'll be on eyes you'll be our eyes and ears. Keep your guard up. Alright, you be careful too. Yep, so for now it's just gonna be Tara unlocked and Oops. Did they unequip everyone else? Yep. Because this is all the stuff that they were all wearing. But we got some new stuff. Alarm earring. Earring capable of detecting enemy ambushes. Prevents back attacks and attacks from the side. That's cool. Gale air, uh, Gale hairpin, sorry. Increases the frequency of preemptive strikes. Nice. Don't know if I'm going to use them. Uh, I'm probably just going to equip uh, the Zephyr Cloak and the Thief Bracer again on unlock. can use the assassin's dagger. Uh, it's not too bad. I think I'd probably rather have the thief knife. Uh, yeah, the thief knife just gives me magic evade. I need to give lock an Esper. I'll give him Bismarck. Actually, no. I don't need to give him Bismarck for right now. To be honest. I could teach him some other stuff. I might give him... This. Until he levels up. Alright, so let's be on our way. Bear a message from the Emperor. Did your decorum at tonight's banquet and your grace in speaking to our soldiers beforehand? Okay, yeah, this is where you get the rewards. The Emperor has decided upon the following. All Imperial troops will be withdrawn from South Figaro immediately. In addition, Imperial forces will be withdrawn from the Kingdom of Doma. It's nice, so we can explore Doma now and we go back to South Figaro. So maybe I could have got the ribbon again. 
Um, I didn't have to go back for it, but... I mean, we don't have an airship right now, so we can't actually go back. We will also unlock the armory at the Imperial Observation Port to the east, so that'll be the locked door that I couldn't get through last time. Welcome to any of the weapons and armor within. And this is a personal gift from the Emperor. Another tint of blah, blah, blah. And they can excuse me. Okay. Don't know if that was all the rewards. But hey. We got access to the armory, which was the locked room. Albrook's a port town to the south of the Empire. Plans to leave for Crescent Island from Albrook on a transport ship carrying Magitek armor. We can keep a close eye on the Empire. You deal with the Espers. I want to go visit Kefka. Because I kind of skipped over him when I was running through. Oh. Oh, that's so good. That's so... That's so good. I'm never able to forgive Kefka. So... Kefka's locked up in a cell. Pooping. <laughs> oh my god, this guy. Fucking hell. So Kafka's locked up, and Cyan is just patrolling, just watching him. You know they could have put Cyan anywhere in the in the palace for you to speak to, but they put him here. That's really good. I really like that. He's just watching him. So I guess we shall be on our way now. Vector done burning down. No, it's it's still burning apparently. Hey Saban. Yeah, I do not trust them in the slightest, but honestly, what else can we really do right now? I mean, if we accuse them of lying to us, they'll just fucking take us down because their numbers are far greater than ours. Let's be real. So before we go back to Albrook, which is the city down to the south. Um, yeah. Um, I'll be going to the uh, the armory, because I want to see what loot we can get in the observation point. Yeah, then we'll head uh, down to Albrook and continue on with the story. But I will do that in the next episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. I'll just meet you over there. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. Be sure to subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.